I thought I'd show you guys this. Uh, and by the way, the noise you hear in the background is a dehumidifier running. But anyway, I got to this call and the uh, blower motor was bad, and it was a X13 motor. Well, this unit's out of warranty, and uh, a new X13 motor was going to be pretty expensive. In addition to the fact that I was going to have to order it, and so this uh, this lady was going to be without air for uh, probably until next week until I get the motor in. And uh, so I went ahead and converted it to a regular PSC motor. Uh, just used a Rescue 5471. And uh, so there's the motor. It's your standard PSC motor. The X13 was a three quarter horse. And this motor is rated on high speed to be three quarter horse with a 20 microfarad capacitor. Uh, I always leave my, when I hang them up with plumbing strap, I always leave it a little bit long. That way, if somebody ever has to change this capacitor, it's a little. Capacitor is a different shape. You've got some, you got some room where you don't have to use a new strap. You can just adjust this. Uh, got my wire strapped up in here, nice and neat. Uh, it was really easy to do the conversion on this one because this one, uh, right here on this board, I've got this wire unplugged. It normally plugs on right there. Uh, that's the 24 volt call that went to the this wire. This blue wire came out and plugged into the X13 motor to, you know, turn it on. So, going from there, with a 24 volt call, I went up to a relay right there that I have turning this PSC motor on and off. The brown coming from the X13 motor, I just went ahead and used that for the common. That's That was the common coming off the X13 motor. It's going down the common off the transformer. This is my high speed wire off my PSC motor and this is my other incoming power leg. Uh, my common is tied in down here to this bundle I've got tied up right there is where I've got white common off my motor and yellow incoming power from the air handler. Just tuck those back in there. Black incoming power from the air handler in here and then my high speed motor, high speed uh, for my motor. So we'll go ahead and put power back to it. And as soon as I plug this little wire into the 24 volt call off that board, and the reason I said that was easier is because this board is what turns the fan on and off. It just sends 24 volts to that terminal anytime it wants the blower to run. So whenever the heat strips come on, whenever the thermostat calls for fan or for cooling or for heat, it sends 24 volts right there. It'll energize that relay and turn the blower on. So we'll go ahead and plug it in here. As you can hear, we've got blower operation. So now this lady will have air conditioning again. And just in case anyone asks, this is where I'm running after putting the new blower motor in there.